10 Most Popular Turkish Drinks Drinks are integral to gatherings with friends and family and crowded dining tables in Turkish culture. Sometimes these drinks even represent a particular type of get-together. For example, making a home visit to a friend or relative is called going for tea. Going to Riki is a term used for eating a meal and drinking Riki al fresco with friends, enjoying live music in a bar, since they are such fundamental parts of Turkish life, it is not wrong to say that drinks in Turkey have symbolic meanings. Let's round up some of the most popular delicious Turkish drinks. 1. Turkish Tea Tea was not a popular drink in Turkey until the 1950s when the coffee bean prices skyrocketed during World War II. Turkish people were addicted to caffeine and needed an alternative so they turned towards black tea, which could grow in Turkey and is highly caffeinated. Turkey now has the highest tea consumption globally, with 3.2 kilograms consumed per capita each year. Turkish tea is often served in tulip-shaped glasses and consumed all day long, especially during breakfast. The redder, more caffeinated, and stronger the tea, the better. This red and strong hue is called tafsin kani which translates as rabbit blood, the perfect word to approve the tea before sipping it. Turkish tea first appears at the breakfast table in a Turkish home, and is usually available right through till dinner time. It is usually drunk from specially produced tulip-shaped glasses, called ince belly, and one or two cups per day is never enough. It varies, of course, but there are even people who drink 20 to 30 cups of tea a day. 2. Aran, Turkish yogurt drink, comma, it is made by mixing yogurt, water, and salt and is often served with meals or as a refreshing beverage. Aran is a healthy and hydrating drink that is perfect for those seeking an alternative to sugary beverages, it is said to have originated in Central Asia and is now widespread throughout the Turkic world. In Turkey, Aran is often made with homemade Turkish yogurt, which gives it a slightly sour taste. The drink is low in calories and fat and is a good source of calcium and protein. Aran often accompanies a meal. The sourness or acidity goes well with meat dishes such as kebab and doner. Turks love the drink so much they wonder how Aran is not as popular all over the world, but secretly they are happy to keep such a delicacy to themselves. Aran is a popular drink in Turkey as it pairs well with many Turkish dishes, including meat dishes, kebabs, lamakin, and pied, you can make Aran with any yogurt you have at home. Mix yogurt and salt together, then slowly add water until you reach the right consistency. 3. Turkish Coffee In 1517, the Ottoman Turks conquered a small Yemeni town named Mocha and took their coffee beans back home. They were unaware that this was the beginning of an empire's favorite drink. Turkish coffee is prepared using very finely ground coffee beans. The coffee is brewed in a cesp pot and served in small cups called fincan. The coffee is known for its intense flavor and thick, creamy texture. Its origin is somewhat debated as some believe it originated in Turkey, while others think it originated in Persia. There is no definitive answer. But what is known for sure is that Turkish coffee has been around for centuries and is enjoyed by people all over the world. The coffee is ground very finely, then the coffee, water and sugar are mixed in a sesf, and it is left to come to a boil slowly on a low heat until it forms a thick, creamy foam. First, the foam is divided into small cups with a spoon, then the coffee is poured into fin cans and served with a glass of water on the side. It is essential to drink plenty of water after drinking Turkish coffee. This is because of the strong taste of the coffee, but there are other suggestions why this is so. One suggestion is that you can tell whether a guest is hungry or not by how they drink the coffee and water they are offered. If their stomach is full, they will drink the coffee first, and if they are hungry, they will drink the water first. Now the host knows to prepare some food to serve, without them having to say a thing. Turkish coffee is delicious. It is perfect for those who appreciate the strong flavor and creamy texture. If you have never tried Turkish coffee, I highly recommend it. Most of these are left in the coffee cup and, if you put your saucer on the top of the cup once you've finished your coffee, turn it upside down and leave it to cool, you can read your fortune in the beautiful patterns the Telf create. For the salgam juice, fermented turnip juice, salgam is a type of fermented drink popular in Turkey and the surrounding countries. It is made from black carrots and turnips that are peeled, sliced, and then left to ferment in a mixture of water and lemon salt. The resulting drink is slightly sour and salty and has a strong umami flavor. 
It comes in both spicy and non-spicy options. One common pairing includes drinking it as a soft drink alongside kebabs, especially at traditional kebab restaurants that offer fat-rich and heavy kebabs. Fermented turnip juice also makes for a potent cocktail that is popular in Turkey. Mixing it with raki, the traditional Turkish alcoholic beverage, creates an intoxicating concoction, thanks to the vitamins A, B, C, and K, calcium, and potassium, it is very beneficial for heart, eye, bone, and dental health and is very effective in removing toxins from the body. Delicious and nutritious, this drink is primarily served with kebabs. It is an excellent meal complement. 5. Salop, Turkish salop is a drink made from orchid roots. It is traditionally served hot and is particularly popular in the winter months. There are many different ways to make salop, but the most common recipe includes salop powder, milk, water, sugar, and spices such as cinnamon and cloves. The salop powder is made from the tubers in the roots of the salop plant, which are boiled and dried in the sun. After drying, they are pulverized into a powder. The powder is also used as a thickener for Turkish ice cream. And salop the drink is as delicious as ice cream, a creamy version that will warm you up. Salop is said to have health benefits too. It is good for the respiratory system and is often consumed by those with colds or flu. It is also said to help with digestion and in relieving stomach pain. Turkish salop is a delicious and healthy drink that has many benefits. It is perfect for warming up on a cold winter day and will surely leave you feeling refreshed and invigorated. Salop, which is often consumed with cinnamon, especially in winter, is a hot and intense drink made of powdered orchid roots, milk, and sugar. This traditional Turkish beverage requires collecting the tubers of the wild orchids, orchid roots are also called salop under the ground and grinding these tubers into powder, orchid roots are rich in starch, and when mixed with milk, it turns into a thick, custardy-like texture. Salop powder is also the key ingredient in Turkish ice cream, as it makes for a dense and chewy treat. Six Boza, Turkish Boza is a fermented drink made from wheat, barley, millet, or maize. It has a thick, creamy consistency and a slightly sour taste. Boza has been made in Turkey for centuries and is thought to have originated in Central Asia. Nowadays, boza is available year-round but is still most commonly consumed in the winter. It is served with cinnamon or yellow roasted chickpeas in boza shops in Istanbul and Eskizhir, cities famous for their boza. Boza is a nutritious drink and is high in protein and vitamins. It is said to have many health benefits, including aiding digestion and boosting immunity. If you are visiting Istanbul in the winter, keep an ear out for the Boza vendors on the streets shouting Boza Axi after dark. They sell the most authentic Boza drinking experience, believe me, it is the most enjoyable way to have this delicacy. 7. Tursusuyu, Pickle Juice Tursusuyu is a refreshing beverage native to Turkey, made from pickled vegetables such as beets, carrots, cabbage, cucumbers, onions, peppers, garlic, and brine. It is salty in flavor, with a strong tangy kick at the end, while its color is bright pink, Tursusuyu is sold by Balak Ekmek, fish sandwich, vendors and is often paired with fish sandwiches or other street food. 8. Narsuyu, Pomegranate Juice, in Turkish mythology, the pomegranate is a symbol of beauty as well as fertility and abundance, this wonderful fruit can be found at every corner in Turkey, and it's not hard to see why. Packed with antioxidants, the refreshing juice made from this citrusy treat has been purported for its numerous health benefits ranging from lowering cholesterol levels to eliminating toxins, even before you start looking for this tangy but delicious drink, you will naturally stumble upon many stands juicing it freshly in Istanbul. 9. Nane Limon, Dried Mint and Lemon, this traditional Turkish drink, Nane Limon, is made by boiling a slice of lemon with dried mint. This potent winter warmer keeps everyone safe from the cold, according to every mother in Turkey, and has also been shown to help fight seasonal sniffles, fresh leaves of black pepper and honey are frequently added to the drink to make it more effective, while not a well-known drink for foreigners or tourists, it is one of the most popular drinks in winter for Turkish people.
10. Turkish Raki. It is said that Greek winemakers in Asia Minor were the first to produce Raki, the anise-flavored spirit distilled from fermented grape pomace. However, it was in Turkey that Raki was heavily popularized, which led to a monopolization of its production in 1923. Most modern-day Raki varieties are based on the use of fermented grapes, raisins, or dried figs, which are mashed, then fermented and distilled in copper columns. The drink is then diluted and combined with anise or optionally fennel seeds in a mixture that would later be distilled into Raki. Raki, a high-octane alcoholic drink with a unique taste of anise, is traditionally served in Turkish taverns. It is made of suma, white grapes pomace, and anise seeds. Turkish raki is potent, having percent 40-50 alcohol thus, it is commonly diluted with water or ice cubes to make the taste more enjoyable and manageable. This drink was given the nickname Lion's Milk due to its wide appearance after it mixes with H2O, since the lion is a common metaphor for a strong and courageous person in Turkey. In Turkey, people drink raki as they enjoy long conversations and partake in a unique appetizer culture. While not the same, raki is similar to Greek ouzo, French pastis, Italian sambuca, and Middle Eastern Iraq. Bonus Sherbet Turkish sherbet is a refreshing drink made from fruits, herb leaves, water, and sugar. It is typically served cold and is a popular choice during the hot summer months. Fruits such as grape, pomegranate, cranberry, black mulberry, and sour cherry can also be used. Rose petals and orange blossom are some of the ingredients used in Turkish sherbets. Turkish sherbet is a healthy drink option as it is made from natural ingredients and is low in calories. It is also a hydrating drink, which is vital during the summer months when we are more prone to dehydration, whether you are looking for a refreshing drink to cool down on a hot day or you want to enjoy a healthy and delicious beverage, Turkish sherbet is a great choice. Rayhan Sorbeti, one of the most widely consumed sherbets, is a traditional Turkish drink made from the leaves of the purple basil called Rayhan. It is pink in color and has a very sweet taste. Rayhan Sorbeti is usually served after a meal and is believed to have many health benefits. It is said to be good for digestion and helps calm nerves. It is also thought to be a good blood purifier. It has been made in Turkey for centuries and is still very popular today. If you are ever in Turkey, be sure to try this delicious and refreshing drink.